Good morning. Welcome to another episode of the vlog. Today, I'm going to meet up with the Connect crew and uh, we're going to do a lap of County Andrum. It will be about 100 miles, 160k, there, thereabouts. So, uh, yeah, should be good. I was meant to be riding the Prudential Ride London a couple of weeks ago, but uh, what with one thing and another, obviously it was cancelled. So, so this will have to do instead around the beautiful Northern Ireland coastline. How are you? Good. Yeah. The, uh, the layering strategies, maybe. Kind of. It's cold. Yeah. It's cold. What's that? That's a thing I'm talking about. It's a microphone. It's a bad job. Mark Kyle's doing the maintenance on your bike. Stop and uh, <laughs> you've got a helmet. <laughs> you've got a helmet mark on your head. Sure, probably. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so arrived at our uh, mid ride coffee stop 50 miles in, um, Bothy up on the north coast, but there is a bit of a queue to get in. Um, I, haven't got a, I haven't got loads of footage of the ride up to the coast yet because, well, the weather wasn't as advertised. It was who went to have the camera out and uh, pretty windy. So, uh, <laughs> <laughs> so we'll get that, get some lunch here and then hopefully stay dry and with a bit of tailwind on the way home. Pizza before you ride home? Ah. Uh, get the roast beef, bone of fries, and then they must have desserts, some desserts and their apple tart. Roast beef. Roast beef fries. Now we're shopping diesel. Enough food there, Marco? Ah, lovely. It's pretty windy up here, so I don't know if you'll be able to hear, but uh, there's a climb out of Castle, which was uh, not too bad, but we did have a 20 mile an hour 
tail end. So we're just waiting on the rest of the guys catching up. And the view up here is incredible. No, I've never been up here in my life. Are you eating the, little, eating the local produce, huh? Oh, it's beautiful. Fresh. But it's sure it's full of exhaust fumes now. <laughs> Been a good ride so far. Um, so we're at 86 miles. Um, so about 14 miles to go, just up over the glens. I know. I. Uh, I think your body has consumed. I tend not to drink caffeine after about two o'clock. All right, Johnny. Cheers. I, like, I really like the Fujis. I shot. I used to shoot with Fuji X100. I've had my eye on the X-T2 and then the X-T3, and then I started getting into vlogging a bit. And the X-T4 has a flip around camera. If you don't so, mind me being nosy or whatever, I'm actually talking for one of us. <laughs> but that's why. And you have it slung on the back on uh, your back on on a bike. This is why I'm going to be shooting your wedding all the time. All right. Okay. So. Better be sure to. Yeah. Little uh, flat white from Twilight to get get me over. Uh, over the glens, back home to Bellamina. I'm not sure coffee's going to get you for a glen. It will. Why wouldn't it? Okay. Caffeine. <sighs> Caffeine will power me up over the hills. That's uh, 93.8 miles done, 27 miles to go. Cadence sensor's done, but... That's the last climb really of the day done, 93.8 miles in the legs and I'm pretty sure I smashed my PR up that, so pretty happy with that. Uh, seven miles-ish downhill home um, and that'll be me done for the day. Well done boys. Right done, that was 110 miles in total um, and about five and a half thousand feet of climbing so um, long day in the saddle. I think that's my longest ride ever, actually, 110 miles. Um, but I feel good, I feel good. Uh, I got my nutrition right today, which helped. Um, I think, you know, I was just making sure I was constantly eating, drinking enough, so that definitely helped. That was a brilliant ride. Honestly, those roads around the coast, um, be it the Causeway Coast up at the north or down the Adrum Coast, kind of down the east coast of, of County Adrum, are incredible. If you get them on a good day, like today, um, they are just absolutely stunning. Um, there's nowhere, nowhere quite like them in uh, my book. Okay, they're not the Alps or the Pyrenees or um, Dolomites or anything, but they're still pretty amazing. Um, and if you're not from Northern Ireland and watching this, you definitely should come to Northern Ireland just to cycle around those roads. They are stunning. And there's loads of good climbs. Um, and uh, if you get a tailwind, it helps. Uh, but um, yeah, absolutely incredible roads. 
This was also my first ride out with this new camera. So I shot the, a lot of the footage from this vlog was shot on my new camera, the Fuji X-T4 um, and the 23 F2 lens. So uh, let me know what you thought of the, the footage. Um, I shot on slow-mo, so um, hopefully that's come out okay and looks okay in the vlog. But, um, but yeah, so leave, leave a comment down below if you, if you um, like the footage from, from today's ride. But now I'm gonna go have a shower get some dinner and then watch the highlights of stage one of today's tour. Um, so yeah, that's the end of the vlog for now. Thanks for watching. If you've enjoyed this vlog, uh, hit like, leave me a comment, that would be great. And uh, yeah, I'd love it if you subscribe as well, that would be amazing. But for now, that's the end of the vlog. I will see you next time.